What makes you feel most at home? Is it the smell of your favorite meal, the feeling of freshly washed sheets, or the sound of your favorite record playing? We experience our homes through all five senses, associating a particular memory and emotion with each. We've enlisted five of our favorite creatives and makers to tell the story of their own homes, framed through the sense they relate to most. We're Lulu in Georgia, and this is Sense of Home. The taste that most brings me comfort and reminds me of home is my mom's pasta sauce. Uh, it's called sugo. It's made with turmeric, cumin, coriander, black peppercorn. Uh, it's sweet, it's savory. I often eat it with a banana like most Somali people do. When I'm missing home, when I'm craving home, that's what I go for. <laughs> I'm Hawa Hassan, and my home feels like a warm hug. It's playful, it's peaceful, um, and it's my sanctuary. Food for me has often been a place where I've built community, um, where I've made connections. And I would say the most important thing to me that food has added to my life is that it's helped me to create memories. The bedrock of my cooking, I would say, can be found in flavors that are reflected in the Indian Ocean. Since the spice trade went through East Africa, I often can be found in my kitchen playing around with cumin, coriander, turmeric, cinnamon. That, that's really what brings together the flavors I enjoy the most. I launched my consumer packaged goods business in 2015 when I saw there was a space um, a white space, meaning that there wasn't an industry that was having a conversation about African foods. And I thought a really good way to elongate the table was to start with condiments. And so here I am, elongating the table. <laughs> I feel most at home when I'm wearing my house dress, AKA Somali Bati. I also feel most at home when I'm sitting on my couch laughing with my loved ones. What gives you a sense of home? 